Welcome to the first in a series of educational videos provided by Bry Air Inc., the choice for desiccant dehumidification. This video is the first in a series that deals with understanding the properties of air and how to use this knowledge to solve moisture and temperature problems in industrial type applications. This video explains the very basic elements of the properties of air. We hope you enjoy these videos, but more importantly, we hope you find them to be useful. The psychrometric chart displays the properties of air. Knowing how to read it is fundamental to determining the elements required to change those properties. With knowledge of any two points, all others can be calculated. In this video, the first of a series brought to you by Bry Air, we'll define the terms related to the chart. Dry bulb temperature is the temperature of air determined with an ordinary thermometer. Here it's shown in degrees Fahrenheit. Wet bulb temperature is the lowest temperature that can be reached by the evaporation of water only. It's the temperature you feel when your skin is wet and it's exposed to moving air. Enthalpy is the total energy in BTUs of a sample of dry air and its water vapor. Enthalpy can't be measured directly, but changes in it can. Dew point is the temperature at which water vapor begins to condense from moist air. Dew is formed because the air is saturated and can't hold any more water vapor. Relative humidity is the ratio of the amount of moisture present in a sample of air compared to how much moisture the air could hold at that temperature, given as a percentage. It's the factor that determines how comfortable we feel at a specific dry bulb temperature. Humidity ratio is the weight of water in a sample of air compared to the weight of the same sample of air with no moisture in it measured in grains of water per pound of dry air. For example, at 70 degrees Fahrenheit, with 30% relative humidity, the humidity ratio is 34 grains of water vapor per pound of dry air. Water vapor pressure is the pressure exerted by the water vapor molecules on the surrounding environment, causing air to move. For example, when you open a door to an air-conditioned space, water vapor pressure causes the moisture air from the outside to be pushed inside. Specific volume is the volume of space occupied by a pound of air measured in cubic feet per pound. That concludes the first video in the series on psychrometrics, the properties of air. Our next video will be posted shortly. If you would like to learn more about this subject or Bry Air, visit our website, www.bry-air.com or call us toll-free at 877-4-BRY-AIR.